It is 11.58. I'm headed back to Ragnar. I debated about getting a bite to eat. I mean, nothing good. It's gonna... Nothing that I could get right now is gonna feel good out on that course, whether I walk it or jog it or run it. Oh, I just had a tortilla and a couple of the little churro donuts. I had some water. And I'm just gonna try to have a muffin when I get there. But we're signing out for today. We're gonna pick up really early. I feel like I could go to sleep right now, but it's either <clears throat> Excuse me, my throat has been really bad with all the dust. I'm either going to be able to go to sleep or I'm going to get there and then have to jump out on the trail. I don't know. It just depends who's sleeping, who's awake. I'm hoping I can get in two hours, like a good two hour nap, and then jump back out and, and then run one leg, jog a leg, whatever it is. But I was even debating about just staying there. <clears throat> Excuse me, because we found someone to help out. With one trail, so it gives us about 45 minutes an hour. And then Tosemi's gonna pick back up and do one more run. And so I was thinking that I could just sleep for an hour, hour and a half, and then drive uh, 35, 40 minutes back. In a couple hours, once we figure out what's going on with the relay, and when we can sleep, and when we can start. Day 998, checking in 1224 in the morning. We're almost back to Ragnar. I told myself I'm feeling tired and ready to sleep. And then this brand new song comes on. This group I used to listen to in high school quite a bit. And I guess they're they're coming back. Goo Goo Dolls, run all night. The song's pause, but I can't play it on the YouTube, but I feel like it's telling me something. I don't believe in signs, but it's telling me something right now that however this goes, we gotta make it happen. We gotta make sure we finish what we started. We're sleeping up for 21 hours. spot now who knows we could get lucky and find one up front and we could find one three or four miles back <laughs> just drive on up see what we find well we're about three miles out so I guess about what I was expecting I just found one spot that was open there was a police car or ranger behind me so I just got to the side act like I was gonna drop someone off turn around we pulled in, we're on the opposite side of the road this time, so we'll just back out and then head out, but we gotta go look for the van, so wish us luck. It is 419, Don's coming in, Jennifer's headed out, and then I'm headed out after Jennifer. All right, Jennifer, nice and easy, all right? Have fun. Well, it's 510 in the morning. I would do another double. So we're doing the rat, 6.6 miles. And then coming back, and we'd be going to green, 4.1 miles. So a 10 mile run is happening. I'm going really easy. Probably the gate of 45 pace, 8 minute pace. Just because. Stomach's not quite settled. I'm having some heel pain on the drive over and drive back. I switch out my shoes and my feet breathe a bit. And I change shoes again. So they're feeling better, but I don't want to push it too much. And we gotta figure out who's doing the last two. And the yellow, and then it comes back to red. Oh, someone's gonna help volunteer. 
do another walk. Then later. Just gonna run off my one loop down. One second. Okay, mile five. One point six to go. Legs are hanging in there. Almost got a sunrise, so when the sun comes up, we'll get a second one in. Just trying to do enough to keep the legs moving. Stay focused, not tripping. It's definitely until I get to stay more focused right now. So, have your legs, tie your brain, body's tired. I don't know how much sleep I got. Less than two hours. I've been like 10 minutes awake, 20 minutes, 10 minutes. I definitely wasn't adequate and I to feel completely energized. But we're going, making it happen. Pinch and zoom. Nail the green. We got the one yellow, one red light. There's our sunset. Yeah, it's not, it's not time. Sunrise. There's our sunrise for the day. About a half mile left. Come on. Sun's coming up. I can almost put the light away. Whoa. Almost hit the mile for the green loop. Alright. One off three to go. Bring it in. Bring it in. Keep it going. We got it, we got it, we got it. It'd take a minute though. So. We got to the exchange point. So now a quick message to the group text. Say, hey, just finished the red. Start in the green. Then we only got one yellow and one red left. It's time to rally. Time to get strong, team. Let's, let's finish this up. I got some kind of notifications. I'm not sure the comment or liked it yet. But try to plant those positive seeds in their head. Don't let them quit. We're two away from finishing the entire thing. That's the way you gotta keep it. You start it, you finish it. Didn't turn out the way you expected. We still. They do adjusted really well. And we got it. We're on our way. We got to see it here. And then before we could put it out here first. So I want to get the negative here yeah, up there. I want to let them know that I'm already seeing it. They just have to see it and leave it too. Soaking this desert scenery. Take a look at that. Just had a little bit of an emotional moment. Random runner stranger. Just say good morning. Before I even got to say good morning. Say good job, you're crushing it. And it's just one of those things that, you know, so thankful to be here. So thankful that have a morning to wake up to. There's my three. Gotta check in and see. Sorry, side train. So thankful to be here. Have a morning to wake up to. So thankful that have a good have a way to be calling it good. Whatever that may be. Today it's for a run and the team and having my health. Happiness, food in my stomach. I tend to sleep at the moment. Family and friends love me and care for me. I think I got a little emotional. I need to take a minute to myself. So I got it and shared it with everybody. Little things happen. You give, you get. And that was my takeaway. 
Everything's fine, Brad. Okay. About 300 meters left till victory. Here we go. Going to the tent. Ah, good to see you, buddy. Good to see you. This is my fifth leg. That's it. My portion's done. My portion plus two more. And finished under two hours. Started at 512. It's now 648. Let's see if the watch will show. 648, 649. Uh, all right, we did what we said we we're gonna do, plus some. And now we can rest. Backing up. Bars on the sides, those all pop up. Do you see guys? Like, um. Like on the inside. These? Nope. Uh, um, these? Where your left hand is, that, where your right hand is, you're on it. Pull that up. Oh, ah. oh there you go. Do that more time. We're at Krispy Kreme. Amazing. Thank you. You want to turn that camera so everyone can see Krispy Kreme down there? We stink and we're dirty and we have dirt. Awesome. Now we have some sugar sweet to go with all this saltiness. Yeah. It's a good one, all the salt because we're sweating. Yeah. Jennifer panicked. She's like, it's 14 miles away. I'm like, well, if we take this road to get to the freeway, that's 12 of the miles. So <laughs> we got to go the extra two. I didn't know it meant the yeah. same way. We got uh, a light away. We were like, the last block. And Jennifer's like, David, where are we? I was like, I recognize this area. <laughs> There's a crispy right here. Best way to end the ride now. Yes. Let's go. I'm just kidding. We're gonna. We're not going. We're gonna get out of here. The emergency brakes on. We're getting out of this car. We're getting out. Oh, are we Jennifer? Dalvi Dal goes. Dalvi Italian Dalvi. Pizza, pepperoni pizza, artichoke, calzone, and. You got the pesto chicken. I got a pesto chicken. One half's already gone. Because I'm hungry and ate it. There's a little bit of pizza. All zone. It's still on its way. But Jennifer said, we both said, we're hungry. So what do we want? And Jennifer said, Italian. And that's like the sandwich place, right? The yes. So here we are. Delicious. Take because I drank too much soda. <laughs> she drank too much soda, so she got a little cold. Trying to wait for the calzone to come because that's what she usually gets. Yeah. But we figured we'd pamper ourselves, not pamper, but spoil ourselves a little bit today with the food because we didn't eat a lot at all. We just kind of had a bunch of snacks. We had a light breakfast this morning, Kobe, but the rest of it we ate really light, so we're really hungry right now. I didn't keep track of how many calories we burned. But I'm sure it's on there for sure. Yeah. I'm sure, I'm sure in the thousands for sure. It's not two or three thousand, so. Yeah, so. I, I mean, it will look just for curiosity's sake, but we're not doing it to like, oh, we need to replace calories. We're just hungry, so. We're just gonna eat all our desire. Exactly. We're gonna eat all of this food. <laughs> Calzone just arrived. And that's the half. That's the half order from the calzone and the pizza. Oh yeah. David, oh, record me eat this and look like an animal. Oh, I forgot to sign off last night. Just to turn into a movie after dinner, and then I just crashed out pretty quick after that. And early, I'm gonna say it's early. It's 8:30. Check it in first thing in the morning, sign it off, and I'll sign back on the next video. So, find your life and health and happiness. See you in the next video. Find your life and health and happiness. Have a good night, and then see you in the next video.